So here I am in the city of Newburgh, New York, yet again. That's like, what, the 300th consecutive time, maybe? And right now I'm looking at this Haro Back Trail Z20 BMX bike. And I'm just trying to find any reason that this thing's interesting. I mean, maybe it's interesting in its ubiquitousness because they seem to have made a ton of these. I find a lot of them. But that's not really interesting. Then there's the, uh, this sort of, is this a wishbone or, I don't know exactly what you call this junction, but it's a pretty cool junction. You know, the way the top tube comes down and then the C2 pierces the top tube and the top tube kind of dips down at a little curve and joins the seat stays. That's mildly interesting. But then the bike has a coaster brake which makes it like a kid's bike, which makes it less interesting. It's got some van stickers on it, but they give those away for free everywhere, so. These Haro pedals are really neat. I don't know. There's your fork. It's a clean looking bike. Aesthetically, it's nice. Got this big ass padded seat, just in case you want to learn bar spins. I'm almost tempted to take this seat off and put it on eBay for like, $24.95. It's got imitation ODI long neck grips poked through on the end. Fusion stem. This back tire is worn through and it's red underneath. So I guess that's mildly interesting, but... Oh, and here's something. The way the kickstand's held on. This bolt and washer set up. The uh, handbrake is gone. I mean, the brake itself is there, but the cable and the lever are gone. These are Haro grips. Probably made by ODI, I don't know, who knows. So, you know, no offense to the Haro loyalists. It's a nice little bike, and I might just leave it right here and write free on the sidewalk or something, because I'm sure some kid in this neighborhood would be happy with it. It's cool. It's strong. It's never going to fall apart. It's well made. Nice style. It's sleek and everything. But there's just nothing about it that really jumps out at me. You know, there's nothing about it that makes me get, like, all, all bike excited. So, you know, I'm, I'm sorry if this video has kind of fallen flat. Maybe I'll cover some more of the parts. Haro grips, Haro steel seat post, Haro seat post clamp, back trail graphics, Tektro brake. I guess that's it. I guess that's it. So that is the uh, high quality, stylish, well built, but not particularly interesting or compelling Haro bikes. Backtrail Z20 kids BMX bike. BMX bike, yeah. It would be interesting if it was called a bike like I just pronounced it, but no. The not quite boring, not quite interesting Haro Backtrail Z20 here as usual in the city of Newburgh. And uh, thanks for watching.